During Operation Desert Storm, A-10s destroyed more than 4,000 Iraqi tanks, artillery pieces and other military vehicles. But on the morning of February 25, 1991, a large column of Iraqi tanks was moving south. Two A-10s arrived over Iraq to engage them at sunrise. The A-10A pilots, carrying AGM-65 Mavericks and 30mm ammunition swooped through the haze and attacked the tanks. It took only 10 minutes for the Warthogs to kill six tanks with Mavericks. Two more destroyed by A-10's mighty GAU cannon. Pilots thought they are done, when all of a sudden they were ordered to go quick and help the Marines in southwest of the Kuwait City. A Marine FA-18 Hornet told the A-10s that two of V-8B Harriers had already been hit, one was downed, and the other was leaving the area on fire. They reached the scene and took out eight more tanks. Then the pilots returned to their base for rearming to support Marines who were now probing at the outskirts of Kuwait City. The A-10 has quickly moved in and set seven more tanks afire. 23 tanks in one day, A-10s set an all-time record for Maverick and cannon kills.